Cooling system in a car engine explained. The cooling system in your car is a closed circuit that helps maintain safe operating temperatures for the engine. This is crucial because internal combustion engines generate high temperatures during operation. The circulation of coolant determines how effectively the engine and its components operate. Modern automobile engines primarily use liquid cooling systems, although some smaller or specialized engines may utilize air cooling. Additionally, lubricating oil plays a role in cooling engine parts to some extent. What is a cooling system in a car? The cooling system consists of components that facilitate the flow of liquid coolant through passages in the engine block and head to absorb heat generated during combustion. The heated coolant then returns to the radiator through rubber hoses for cooling. As the heated coolant flows through the radiator's thin tubes, it is cooled by airflow. Functions of engine cooling system. The primary function of the cooling system in internal combustion engines is to manage the extreme heat up to 1500 to 2000 degrees Celsius generated in the combustion chamber. Without proper dissipation, engine materials could melt, leading to serious damage and failure. Another critical function is to regulate the temperature of the lubricating oil that cools and lubricates moving engine parts. Excessively high temperatures can oxidize the oil, causing carbon deposits and potentially leading to piston seizure. The cooling system is designed to remove at least 30% of the heat generated by the combustion process without compromising the engine's thermal efficiency. It operates efficiently by quickly dissipating heat during high engine temperatures while allowing components to reach optimal operating temperatures shortly after startup. Components of engine cooling system. Radiator. Composed of aluminum tubes and fins that dissipate heat, the radiator allows heated coolant to flow through it via hoses. Air passing through the radiator cools the coolant before it returns to the engine. Cooling fan. Positioned near the radiator, the cooling fan directs airflow to enhance cooling efficiency during engine operation, ensuring the radiator remains at optimal temperature. Pressure cap and reserve tank. Modern radiators feature pressure caps to maintain system pressure as coolant expands. The cap includes a spring valve calibrated to specific pressure levels releasing excess coolant if pressure exceeds the set limit. Water pump. Located at the engine's front, the water pump circulates coolant throughout the system while the engine is running. It typically features an impeller blade to facilitate coolant movement. Thermostat. A valve that regulates coolant flow based on engine temperature. When the engine reaches a specific temperature, the thermostat opens, allowing coolant to flow to the radiator for cooling. Heater core. Similar to a miniature radiator, the heater core uses heated coolant to provide warmth to the vehicle's interior when needed. Connected to the engine's cooling system via hoses. Hoses. Flexible hoses facilitate coolant circulation between the radiator, engine, and other components within the cooling system. Bypass system. This component allows coolant to bypass the radiator and return directly to the engine when the coolant temperature is high enough to open the thermostat, maintaining temperature balance. Working principle. The cooling system operates by circulating liquid coolant through the engine's passages, absorbing heat from the combustion process. After absorbing heat, the coolant returns to the radiator via hoses, where it is cooled by airflow entering the engine compartment. This process is crucial for maintaining engine temperature within optimal limits, enhancing overall efficiency and longevity. If this video was helpful, please consider subscribing to this channel. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.